So, progression through the season, how do you think it's been? Uh, in terms of the side in, in general? Yeah. Yeah, you know, I think it's been alright. I say slow start on tour, but really peaked at that Craig House game. It was fantastic. And then you know, coming into that pre season was really special stuff. And uh, got, got the big wins early on. Shame to fall down to the St. Pools and Sherbourne. Uh, you know, quite a few injuries the first half of the season. Myself included, obviously. Still looking to come back. But uh, yeah, yeah. And I think the team going propagating in the right sort of uh, sort of direction, which is what, what we want. I'll give you that. <laughs> um, yeah, Good start, start, start was exceptional. Yeah, the start was the best rugby we've played all season. And if you were to um, draw together a performance of how you manage these conditions and you play a game of rugby, then that's it. That was perfect. Okay. The only thing we, we make it difficult for ourselves. Yeah, we can't get ahead. You know, and, and think we've won the game because these types of opponents they'll come back. And as we said before, if you, if you give them an inch. You know, suddenly we're making it difficult for ourselves. But once again, you know, I think I say this all the time, the character that you've shown at the end there and the discipline to go through phases, yeah, and, and you just know how to win, you know, and that's something that can't be taught. Okay? And we're into serious rugby now, boys. Alright, it's cup rugby, it's Eton, it's Bradley. Yeah? Quality stuff, gents. Really good. Pat, just very quickly from me. Well done. Fantastic performance. Great way to finish off the game. Yeah, my nerves were shredded at the end, but you <laughs> kept cool. A great technique and great start. So well done. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We move on now. Thank you. 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 Chop our feet. Yeah, we okay. chop our feet. Okay, it's the same thing. If we're especially on that soft defence, we, we talk about almost like treading water. Okay, you've got to be soft on your feet. So if he comes, okay, you're in a position to make the hit. If the ball goes, bang, you can push off. All right, and then we go. Okay, uh, switch attackers and defenders. All right, uh, still two sets of five defenders, so we can roll. Still about the RGS game. Tell me everything about it. It was obviously a yeah, great spectacle. Tough conditions. I think the boys really rallied together when the uh, pink or army turned up. It's always a special moment. Do you think they thought they were going to run away with yeah, it? Yeah, so quality first 10 minutes, obviously. Two early tries and uh, I wouldn't say they they laid back, but I think we're guilty of trying to play the game out uh, when we should be trying to finish them off. I think improvement, we didn't actually improve through the game. We started really well and it kind of fell off. But I think we just we stayed as a team. That's what won us again. What, what picked you up? What, what spurred you on? I think the fact that we uh, almost lost, yeah. then uh, we couldn't do that. So yeah, we just don't want to lose a game. Especially in the, in the build-up to this Radley game. Yeah, exactly. Do you think the whole team is motivated? Yeah, I think so. I think we're, we're ready for it. It's going to be a stormer. Okay, okay. Yeah, no, the boys are confident. It's their. Uh, hope there's a good calm, calmness and expectation. We've been focusing on performances. So coming up with maybe two or three key goals for each of them, because it's about for me, not just focusing on the win, but the outcome will take care of itself if the performance elements within that. 
um, are, are covered and focused on. And also it takes the emphasis off who we're playing because it's going to be a big game particularly for them. But if you can pull that emphasis off of who we're playing and focus on yourself, you end up with a better, calmer performance and hopefully the mindset will, uh, will be right. improved through training this year what we got better at training <laughs> learning how to train training well training hard consistently not just in patches okay. um, and that's still a work on to be fair but that's something that they've they've really done very well at in the last few weeks I mean last Friday we had a training session didn't we with team run we had under 15a 16a and first team all training together and um, you've got the younger boys looking at the older boys wanting to emulate them you've got the older boys not wanting to make you make a mistake so they're training well so I think the big thing has been you can't just turn up on a Saturday and expect to perform well all the time. It's been a, keep trying to be consistent in training and working hard because that will affect the game and the performance. Um, but really proud of them, they're fantastic, aren't they? Great bunch of guys. So I'm hoping that uh, you know, we'll do the business tomorrow and, and on Wednesday. Cracking. All right, all right. Do not oh, know you're not getting filmed. Right, let's talk Radley, boys. Oh, what are yeah. you thinking? Okay. Just got to get a job done on the day. Okay. Not about the win, it's about the performance. We're going to smash them. Looking forward to the raggy game. Yeah. <laughs> what, what, what are we looking good at? Everything. How do you think you're going to win the game? Have fun, play hard, make some memories. That's the, uh, that's the passive dream. I think the Radley are going to offer the usual. And it's going to... It's going to be normal and we're gonna do well. <laughs>
time. It's probably banter. Okay, keep our heads because we've seen before we start games well, okay, and then we start trying to chase it and we try and close it out too early. We'll and then what happens? We make it difficult for ourselves, yeah. Obviously, we're up 20 points, we've done quite well. Where we're, we're, we're about, so we're actually really strong in that pitch, um, middle of the pitch, competing. Um, line out's going well, okay. I think what did you do us for there? Um, like truck and trailer, okay, that's fine. It happens. It, it happens. We'll just stick to ones in the air. Our discipline's been good in defence. I think that's partly down to guys from outside telling them to leave it. We haven't fought <coughs> as much as much. Because in the last that. two games, we've had good first half, haven't we? And we've talked about ultimate performance this week and attention to that detail. The outcome will take care of itself. All right, don't worry about that scoreboard. You look at that at the end of the game. Right now, it's about making sure that we start the second half how we started the first. We exit properly, we put pressure on them around those set piece areas, we force a mistake and then we capitalize and we're patient in our work. Little things, don't go off our feet and make sure at scrum time when we're dominant, all right, we absolutely listen, but we also go forward as well and we, we, we use that strength. Boxy? Boys, for me, we talk about creating moments, talk about creating history. This second half is your opportunity, okay? This game can either go down all right, as a 2015, okay, a 2017, and you scrape through, or you keep your composure, you pin them down there, and suddenly we're looking at 30, 40 points, yeah. and it's an absolute hammer. Yeah. Okay, yeah. but the decision and the outcome is within this circle. Okay, so yeah. we kick off, we give them no easy outs, wait for them to make the mistake, and then bang, our foot's back on the throat, and we're back in the game. Everyone happy? Okay, yeah. 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 Oh, Three, two, one, go! Great scrummage.
Absolutely brilliant, boys. All right, a really, really awesome performance. Right, loads of positives there. I'm so proud of you. That's absolutely brilliant. On home pitch, and particularly for the upper sick, five years, possibly seven years for some of you. You know, it's one of those things that you always dream of. You finish on the first team pitch, you beat beating Radley on here. Well done. All right, absolutely brilliant. And uh, hey, this guy here, all right, helping, it's uh, done so well on this. Celebrate with the guys. Alright, celebrate with the guys now. Make sure we see the parents. And point two, hey, absolutely 100% we enjoy today and we wake up tomorrow and we're looking forward to going into the final eight on Wednesday. Yeah.